Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you guys my new 7am morning routine. Ever since the holidays, my sleeping schedule has been messed up as I've been sleeping anywhere between 2 and 5am and waking up well after 12. 2021 is a new year and in efforts to be more productive, I've decided to start waking up earlier and to have a healthier lifestyle as well. Some of the footage is filmed in real time and others are filmed during the day so the lighting is better. So I start off the morning the best way I know how, which is cuddling and playing with cute little Mr. Ollie. Gotta start off my day strong, you know? And since I've been sleeping in lately, Ollie isn't used to waking up early either. At least we're both in this together. After I've woken up a little, I open my blinds to let some light in and to see if I can catch the sunrise. It's also just so peaceful in the morning, you can even hear the birds chirping. I think Ollie was thinking the same thing as well. Either that, or he's just bird watching. I guess we'll never know. Next, I have to feed a hungry, hungry kitty. He usually screams like he hasn't been fed in days, but he's a little quieter today. I guess he's not fully awake yet. Now that I've gotten Ollie settled, I start my official morning routine, which includes taking out my nighttime contacts, brushing my teeth, and also brushing my hair. I usually stay in my pajamas all day, but I started changing into outside clothes just to get into a different mindset. I'm still opting for something comfy though. And as soon as I step outside my room, the dogs awake from their slumber, which means it's time for a walk. Ever since the pandemic, I've stopped going to the gym and have been exercising less and less. So this year, I wanted to focus more on my health. A walk first thing in the morning really gets my blood pumping and helps jumpstart my day. Plus, I get to spend more time with my pups and watch the beautiful sunrise as well. The great thing about waking up and going for a walk early in the morning is that no one else is out. It's just you and nature. Once I get back, I feed the dogs and then make myself a nice cup of iced matcha latte. This is the brand of matcha I'm currently using as I've been trying out a few different ones to see which one I like. This one has been pretty good so far, so I might buy it again. Also, I'm drinking matcha instead of coffee because I'm not a coffee person. I usually never drink coffee, only once in a while, usually during the holidays when Starbucks has their seasonal drinks. My favorite is the peppermint mocha. I just can't get used to the taste of coffee unless there's a ton of sugar and a lot of other added flavoring. Black coffee and espresso shots are no-go for me. I also enjoy matcha more because it has a lot less caffeine in it and has a lot of health benefits as well. And even though it's winter time and freezing outside, I still make ice lattes because one, it helps me wake up in the morning, and two, I just like ice drinks in general. I also got this new whisk from Amazon that really helps bring out the matcha flavor and makes the experience of making lattes in the morning a little more exciting. So please enjoy the footage of me making my beautiful and tasty matcha latte. Next up, I go back to my room and work on some sticker designs while sipping on my latte. If you guys didn't already know, I want to launch a sticker shop sometime this year, so I've been working on my designs in my free time. Also, the design that I'm working on in this video is now my first official sub emote for my Twitch channel. The link is in the description if you guys ever wanted to drop by and hang out while I stream. I usually stream 5 times a week starting at 8pm central time. And all the graphics and designs that you see on my stream are all hand drawn by me. Mm -hmm. 
Now, after working on some designs, I take a quick break to finish up any outstanding tasks I still need to do for the day. Now, this varies from day to day, but in this video, I'm just folding and putting away my clean laundry. I usually leave all my clean clothes in the basket after I wash them and just grab clothing items as I need them in an effort to save time. But I can never find what I need that way, especially with socks. I usually find one sock and can never find the other one. So now I try to put away my clothes in an effort to be more organized. Afterwards, I head back to the kitchen to eat some breakfast. Usually I don't eat breakfast, but waking up at 7 means there's a larger gap from when I wake up to lunchtime. So I would get pretty hungry if I didn't eat. I opted for a simple cereal breakfast. Nothing too fancy like those acai fruit bowls or avocado toasts that you see people on Instagram eating. My favorite part of eating cereal is drinking up all that sugary milk at the end. That's the best part. And the good thing about this brand is that it tastes exactly like Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but it has more nutrients and grains and less sugar, so I don't feel as guilty eating it. Now that we got breakfast out of the way, I go back to my room and use the last remaining time I have before work to edit some videos. I usually start work anywhere between 8 to 9, so I still had some time left over. And Mr. Ollie follows me everywhere I go, so here he is just chilling on my desk. He looked way too cute, so I had to go and bother him. <laughs> I ended up getting distracted as he came over and wanted more attention, so that's why I get for bothering him. He's such a lap cat, and I just couldn't resist not petting him. So instead of editing, I spent the remainder of my free time with Ollie. I mean, look how cute he is. Morning routines don't always go to plan, and that's okay. Overall, I had a really productive morning, so I'm really proud of myself. I tried this for a week, but might start implementing this routine into my daily life. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!